Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we will try to understand DF, don't fragment field in the IPv4 header. The concepts like identification, MF and fragment offset has already been discussed in our previous videos. If you haven't watched those videos, please watch those videos and come back here because the understanding of those concepts is very important for you to understand what we are going to discuss in this class. And this uh, and every video in our channel is going to be part of entire course or a playlist. Our suggestion is to follow the entire course so that you can have better understanding of the concepts and the link for the playlist is provided in the description below now coming to this class df don't fragment field so this is the field here we are going uh, this is the field and it, it is a one bit field so what this df field states is whenever the sender sets this field as uh, one so what happens is uh, the routers in between in the transmission of packet from source to destination to understand this let's take this network so a wants to communicate with b and it has a packet size of for example assume that it is a uh, uh, thousand bytes of uh, packet size and uh, uh, here we are having network header network header and uh, uh, in this sorry thousand bytes of data in this network header if the df is set to one if the df is set to one so uh, as and when the packet is received at the router so now for example assume that this is 500 bytes of data so this is the mtu the mtu for this network is 500 bytes of data now as and when the router receives this packet usually what what it will do is it will based upon the network to which this packet has to be transmitted it will it will fragment this packet into small small pieces but if the df is set to one if the df is set to one means here if the df is set to one it means that the sender don't want this packet to be divided into fragments so the uh, uh, don't fragment states that don't divide this into fragments now what the router will do what the router will do is as and when if 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 it needs to divide it into fragments uh, otherwise it is not possible for this router to transmit it into uh, into this network right so now as it is set to one what the router will do is it will discard this packet so this packet will get discarded it means that it is not going to transmit it further and in response in response what what the router will do is it will send an error message so it will send an icmp message about this concept we will discuss in our later videos so what it will send is it will send an error message stating that you have assigned you have set the bit df to one so uh, there is a need for me to uh, for me to fragment into 500 bytes so i cannot transmit it please uh, uh, make a note of it so this is the message that has been sent by the router to this sender now what the sender will do is based upon the requirement of the router so it will divide the, that packet into small small pieces based upon the requirement to which the router has to divide uh, uh, fragment that big packet into small small packets based upon it this sender will divide that packet and again transmit it so that is what that is the what the use of because there are some uh, there are some requirements where uh, where the sender don't want the packet to be fragmented into small small pieces by the routers in between routers in such cases uh, this df is set to one hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching